Hey guys, we're looking to replace furnace and possibly AC. So we actually did the second floor furnace a couple weeks ago, and then now the main floor furnace, which there's two of them twin together, no longer operational for both, just one is only operational. Blue liner is already in place. Got a 5x4x3Y, by by which will change that out to a T. Oh, so the coil that is still hooked up, from what I can tell and what I see outside, is actually that coil there. So we got two furnaces twin, two coils, and it's also marked on here not used, but I wanted to verify with the line, so. So what plan on if we're doing furnace only. I was looking to do a furnace, turn it to face our way, which I was planning on doing it here. Because the electric and gas is already in place. Unless we find it easier to push it back. Problem is if we push it back. We'll just, eh, we could probably do that. We'll just have to rework and cut the ductwork. Going straight up and patch it off. And then we'll just rework the gas and electric over to there. So yeah, if they want to keep AC, we'll just push the furnace back underneath that coil. We'll cut this ductwork on this side where we need to. And then just make a new front plate for it. But we'll still face the furnace this way. New return drop with the media on it. Put a new header up there. Whoever did the work before just stuck a piece of metal up there and seal it up. Let's seal up both headers. Uh, there's already a humidifier on the back side of there, which we'll need another new number 35 pad. We'll get rid of this humidifier. Got one combustion grill down low. Walk out basement there. We'll have to add another combustion grill up high. Uh, but we have one supply register there feeding this area. So we'll probably just end up putting another combustion grill in the door. Good luck.